lost my voice. I'm gonna have to get my tablature books out and my CDs and practice lots. So stuff I used to know. So, but there's a time when you're not supposed to copy other people and you need to develop your own style. So, um, that's what I'm trying to do anyway, is just come up with different, uh, things and there, I waste a lot of time. It seems that I'll just let <clears throat> everything roll for 20 or 30 or 40 minutes and out of those 20, 30, 40 minutes, or it usually ends up being maybe a minute at the very most compiled altogether out of that 30 or 40 minutes. That is something I want to keep that I like. But most of it is just filler and garbage and not really anything to, <clears throat> to brag about ever. But uh, like I said, like out of about an hour of playing and just letting tape roll or whatever roll, there ends up being a minute or two usually of some stuff somewhere there that I'd like to go back and piece together. That's why I keep all my cruddy stuff and you hear my cruddy stuff and I hope you hear me uh, um, getting a little better, <laughs> a little, a little tiny bit better every day or every session thing. <laughs> I try to keep real simple, just make up uh, rhythm parts generally. And then later, I need one of those machines. It's not an AV box that switches speaker to speaker. Those are really cool. I used to have one. But uh, a looper, a loop, so I can play rhythm and then press a button and it'll replay my rhythm back while I play a lead over it. And that's what I need because I actually need two guitars because for me to try to keep up. <laughs> Shanker thing from my long time ago it was something like that in there. <laughs> 